Hello everybody, Novato Jones here again, video number four of our Skylanders figure guide. And the last couple of videos we talked about uh, the difference between Series 1 Spyro's Adventure and the Giants set. Now what, why are they called Giants? Well, it's because of guys like this. This is Tree Rex. This is the first Giant released. And this is the reason Giants is called Giants because of these larger figures. Uh, you see it from the beginning of the base is almost double the size. The figure uh, is larger in every way. Uh, towers over the regular figures are heavier if you see them. Uh, now Tree Rex here is the one that came with the Giants starter pack and um, along with a couple of the other um, uh, figures but uh, this is the only actual giant figure to come with it and uh, they, they play larger in game um, when you use them with giants, there's a couple spots that require a giant, you know, to uh, move mountains, <laughs> drag islands around with him. Uh, they can jump through some of the ground. I mean, they're they're fun to play. Um, we like uh, it's one of our favorites is uh, Tree Rex. He has the the wood detail, got the big uh, tree horns, uh, knotted wood detail, and uh, all the giant figures from the giant series have uh, basically a light core feature. In this case, his eyes light up, and uh, the little piece on his arm lights up. Uh, in the game, it becomes kind of like a laser beam, but it's pretty cool to see it uh, in hand. Now, what we talked about with, um, uh, like, the Double Trouble. He had the Royal Double Trouble, actual variant in-game. So when you put it on the portal, it actually plays differently. Uh, in this case, Tree Rex, standard Tree Rex, plays like this. There was another figure that originally came... Uh, you bought a set, uh, for example, the uh, uh, Blue Wii version uh, was one way to get them, uh, and it's Gnarly Tree Rex. Eventually he became available in a single pack, available just about everywhere. And what's cool is uh, it's kind of that, I don't know if it's a blackened wood, maybe petrified supposed to be, or just a different type of uh, wood he's made out of, but all the details there, but it's a darker wood. Uh, more blue instead of the red. Uh, eyes light up still, um, and the arm still lights up, but they are different colors. Uh, uh, and when you put them in game, it actually comes on this gnarly Tree Rex, which is uh, pretty cool. Same orange base, um, so these are still, you know, uh, they haven't done a Series 2 of any, in any of the Giants figures, and it doesn't look like they're planning to, so this is considered a Series 1, again, of the figures, but an in-game variant. Uh, and... Uh, on your, when you put the figures on the game, they keep track of your of your of you know what figures you have, and it's considered a separate character, uh, or you know a separate collection. Um, right here, are side by side. Uh, my personal preference is the gnarly tree Rex. I kind of like the dark, the dark colors better. Uh, and he's a little bit hard to find. Uh, originally, it, it it took a little more work to 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 get him, or it's a little more difficult, a lot more expensive to get originally. Uh, then he's released single pack, so uh, at least in the U.S. Um, and he's released separately in, or differently in other countries, but uh, that's the way to get him. Um, all the upgrades are the same as, as as both figures, but like I said, the color is different. Uh, then well, now we're talking about the, the the giants. We'll also take a look at um, something kind of new, um, and it was the sidekicks. This guy's name is Barkley. He's a small version. Uh, as you can see, of Tree Rex. Uh, this was a mail away uh, through Free to Lay. They had to um, get the bag of chips. Uh, mail away, I think it was like $2.50. Uh, and unfortunately, for some, it seems to be only a U.S. Um, promotion. But uh, you mail it away, send you 2 dollars and then you wait, and you can get the, the. This is one of four of the sidekicks for that, uh, for that series. Um, they did sidekicks also for uh, Series 1 as well. Uh, I'll cover those as I cover the the figures because all the sidekicks are basically baby versions, little kid versions of the other guys. And you can't really play them. You put them on, they, they act like a magic item. Uh, I'll show you the difference here. And and the little guy will follow you around the, uh, the screen. But you can see the difference. There's Barkley, and then there's uh, Tree Rex. It's kind of fun to put them together on the game and play with them. Um, but uh, oh, and the the sidekicks, you know, they show up more like a magic item. So you can't use them if you're using things like the uh, treasure chest, or whatever. The game usually allows only one magic item, and um, so this be be considered that. 
but really cool sculpt. Got the same wood detail um, as the standard tree rex. Uh, the base is, uh, you know, pretty standard base. Uh, the life plant one. But uh, the promotion end on this, you can find them sometimes at GameStop. They were doing a promotion, uh, eBay stuff like that. They do cost a bit to, to find if you weren't lucky enough to get them all, all on the uh, the original promotion. Um, not really an asset in game. You know, they don't help you beat the game or anything like that, but they are cool to see these little guys running around. Uh, so grab them if you can. They're fun. Um, thanks for watching the video. That's it for the uh, Tree Rex and Gnarly Tree Rex and Barkley. So uh, we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.